Hello, my beautiful friends, and welcome to a very special edition of the Yeti Bartender. It is a holiday edition, and I am making a reindeer mule. Prosec ho 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 for this very special Yeti Bartender. And while this drink doesn't have Prosecco in it, it does have some of my favorites, and it actually is my favorite holiday drink of all time. So the reindeer mule had this drink at a local restaurant that we love local restaurant slash brewery several years ago last year they took it off the menu and i don't know why because it was wildly popular and i was so sad but i had taken a picture of the ingredients so i knew that i could create this at home and it is so incredibly special and festive like i said because it involves some homemade cinnamon cranberry simple syrup yum Mo. So let me tell you what is all in this very festive menu and this recipe actually creates two. The entire recipe is going to have its own blog post on Living on Cloud 9 because that's how great it is and you're going to want it for Thanksgiving, for Christmas, all season long. So it involves Fireball. Love Fireball liquor. For two of them you are going to want um, an ounce, an ounce of the Fireball. This is a new to me liquor. It's seasonal. It's Jack Daniels Winter Jack, a yummy, yummy whiskey cider. So good. You are going to want an ounce and a half of that. I have squeezed a lime. You're going to want an ounce of lime, a 12 ounce can of ginger beer. And to make the cranberry simple syrup, it is so easy. So this will make enough um, simple syrup for like maybe four to six. You want a cup of cranberries, cup of sugar, cup of water, and a couple cinnamon sticks. You boil that, let it simmer for about 10 minutes, and then strain it through a mesh strainer until you have this beautiful red syrup left over. Store this in the fridge. It will stay good for up to three weeks so you can make you lots of cocktails. Yummy, yummy, yummy. So let's get to creating this. I mean, I seriously cannot wait. So, of course, you're going to want ice in your Yeti, as always. And you're also going to want to fill your Moscow Mule. You know how good these are chilled. You're going to want to fill those with about half of ice as well. So we've got those mugs already. So what we want to do is we want to take our ounce of Fireball, our ounce and a half of the Winter Jack Whiskey. And I know that usually mules are made with vodka, but why not use whiskey, right? I'm telling you, it's good. Trust me on this one. Then we've got our ounce of the lime juice. So that cinnamon cranberry simple syrup I made, you're gonna want about a third a cup. That's just the right amount of sweetness. And I did use half sugar, half stevia in this, so it was not so sugar laden. Oh, it's so worth it though, you guys, so worth it. So we're gonna wanna shake those ingredients, give it a really, really good shake. As always, maybe play some Christmas tunes while you're shaking, jingle bells. Okay, then you're gonna wanna divide that evenly into your Moscow Mule mugs. Look at that beautiful red color. Can you see that? It is so, so gorgeous, you guys. So gorgeous. See how pretty? Shake all that out of there really, really good. Okay, now you take a 12 ounce can of your ginger beer and you wanna divide that evenly, about six ounces, ounces each between your Moscow Mule mugs. They kind of fizz up that carbonation in the ginger beer. Oh my gosh, so good. Now, of course, I'm going to garnish. So I'm gonna throw some cranberries in there, fresh cranberries. I am going to throw maybe a couple lime wedges in there and then on the side, and I may even add some mint too, but on the side, of course, I always like a little lime spiral here to make it extra pretty. And you guys, I made one already to show you how beautiful the red color is. You do not have to put them in Moscow mule mugs, but I think they're super festive in there, but I'll probably drink this one too. Look how Gorgeous. Cheers to the holiday season. Go make your reindeer mule right now. Till next time on the Yeti Bartender.